the best weed killer. Before you had an excuse after this video, get out. The best weed killer. You're not gonna find this stuff at Walmart. You're gonna have to go down to the farm store, your local co-op. This stuff I actually found at Tractor Supply. And what you're looking for is glyphosate. And look at the concentration. This stuff here is 41% glyphosate. That's exactly what you're gonna need. This is just some knockoff brand, but you're looking for high percentage of glyphosate. Should be able to get 41% at any of your local farm stores. Now, let me show you what not to go buy. This is the stuff that you don't wanna get. Everybody knows this brand. They spend millions on marketing, but look at the uh, ingredients. There's glyphosate. Is it focused there? 1% glyphosate. $18 and some change and you're getting 1% glyphosate. This other stuff I got, same price, same size bottle, 41% glyphosate. Don't get the round up. Listen to me. You're getting ripped off. This 41% glyphosate jug is the same price as the 1% glyphosate Roundup that they sell at Walmart. So when you buy Roundup at Walmart, what you're paying for is somebody to take a cap full of this stuff, put it in a jug and water it down, and you're paying the exact same price for it. So now, never get Roundup again. You're paying that inflated price for all their marketing you see on TV or whatever. Get this stuff. Now I'm gonna show you how to mix it real quick. Uh, the instructions say just to use one cap full of this in a one gallon sprayer and these only cost $15 so even if you're only going to do this one time hey it's worth it there and I use this on all the fence rows along the driveway in the shrubs in the front yard today I'm actually going to spray it on a whole front yard here to kill all the weeds to get ready for being seeded so the instructions say one cap full for this whole gallon now, I'm just gonna fill up the rest with water and get to spraying here. And this is some stout stuff. You wanna be sure not to get it in your eyeballs or anything like that. Now I'm gonna run down here and show you the yard that I'm gonna be spraying. And this stuff will start working after 24 hours, but it will can take up to a week for the plants to completely wither and die. So don't expect the plants to start to wither the moment they touch <clears throat> this glyphosate but within a week it should all be close to being dead and this mixture will also last up to 12 months so if you spray your fence row with this stuff this concentrate you may not have to worry about the weeds coming up for another 12 months all right you see all this yard behind me I'm gonna spray this entire yard once it's done I'm gonna take some photo and some video day by day just to show you how this stuff works over time but I'm gonna get to spraying see some of these weeds are seven feet tall here so this will show you how effective this stuff is on some major weeds this is day two after I sprayed the weed killer so the leaves are starting to wilt a little bit but if you didn't know that I had sprayed you probably couldn't tell a difference so really after two days still not much of a change here hey we're on day three now if you look the weeds are looking a little bit more sad the leaves are sagging a little bit more here on day three but 
you can still tell even on day three not a huge difference hey everybody this is day four since I sprayed the glyphosate so check it out today I think is the first day that you could actually see with your eyes that the plants are starting to die here the weeds are dying these uh, you can see some of them are turning yellow there and then some of these are actually shriveled up but even looking at the larger ones there they're starting to wilt a little more and some of the lower leaves have started to turn yellow you can see there so day four is about when you should start seeing the plants start to wilt here hey it's day five you can see the plants are turning a little bit more yellow let me zoom in here see the top leaves on the plants there are starting to wilt and some of the leaves are turning more and more yellow but right here just across the street you can see how yellow these are the plants that I sprayed that are more like grass it has affected much quicker it's day six now and you can really tell a big change in the weeds because of that glyphosate that we sprayed let's look up close quite a bit of it has already started to turn black and shrivel up here day seven here you can see even more and more of these weeds have turned black hey it's day eight here checking in on the weeds again if you look and it's worth mentioning I have no idea what kind of weeds these are that are standing up in this uh, yard but you can tell almost everything has turned black here on day eight and it's worth mentioning anything that's let me show you this grass over here that I sprayed too anything that's grass has already fallen over by day eight that this taller six seven foot crazy weeds are still standing but they're all turned black so day nine here you can see there's more wilting turning black and even falling over now so by nine days most of the weeds you're going to spray this on are going to have died Hey, it's day 10 here, and you can see even the biggest of the weeds are starting to wilt on their heads and start to fall over. So, but these heavier, thick weeds, for the most part, have all turned black. You can definitely tell where I missed some spots when I sprayed. Yeah, a little patch of green stuff there. Hey, it's day 11 here now. After spraying this weed killer, you can see a lot of the tall, thick weeds have started to fall over now. Even these six, seven foot tall weeds that are in here have started to fall all over. And all the smaller ones here by the road have already shriveled up black and died completely. Hey, day 12 here. You can see just about everything's dead. I sprayed both sides of our drive here. So, to give you a view of how it's pretty much just killed everything down both sides of the drive 12 days later <laughs> I think I'm gonna call it a wrap here after 12 days if you look all the stuff that I sprayed it's pretty much you know all dried up and brittle uh, there's no green left in it it's all just dry and breaking right off. Remember, do not go buy the Roundup. Now you don't have any excuse. Go get the concentrate from your farm store, your co-op, and mix it with water yourself. It's the same price. Uh, you'll be glad you did. You get a lot more bang for your buck that way. But thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to share the video. 
and give us a shout on all our social media channels. Love hearing from you guys. Hoo-dee-hoo!